Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out a lot. So hit that subscribe button. Today we're gonna to be making a purple flower resin coaster. So let's jump in and get started. I went ahead and mixed up my resin off camera. Today I'm using the Platinum 360 resin from Laura's Art Corner. I poured three ounces of clear into my mold and drop down about 15 drops of the purple alcohol ink from Let's Resin. And now we're gonna go in and draw our flower petals. For my flower petals, I'm using a silicone paintbrush and angel white epoxy paste from Laura's Art Corner. If you wanna see step-by-step -step how I mix up my white that I use for my resin flower coasters, I will link that video down below. I show you step by step how I mix up my white. I just cut it out of this video to save time because I do it the same way every time I make these coasters. So I started out by drawing just little small petals in the center of my mold here. And then I'm gonna add a few more just to make like a cluster of petals. And then I'm gonna make the petals bigger as I go out towards the perimeter of the mold. And I did mix up my resin off camera just to save time, but if you're new to resin and you want to see a tutorial showing step-by-step -step how I mix my resin, I will link my Milky Way coaster tutorial down below in the description box. Be sure to go check it out. I show you step-by-step -step how I mix my resin and my pigments. Um, I do it the same way every time I mix up my resin. So I'm just gonna keep on drawing my flower petals. This technique is so super simple and easy to do, and I promise you will get the same results that I do if you use the same products that I'm using. Um, you can get the Angel White Epoxy Paste and the Platinum 360 Resin from Laura's Art Corner, and I have a coupon code for you as well to save 10% if you guys wanna give these products to try but it's really easy to do. Um, I know right now it looks like a crazy mess and really awful, but just, I promise you, it turned out so gorgeous. Here we are the next day, ready to demold it, and you can see all the kind of depth and dimension in there from the flower petals and by making the petals smaller in the center and then working our way out towards the perimeter of the mold, we made the flower petals a little bit larger. Uh, the Platinum 360 resin works really well for resin flower coasters. Um, they've been turning out really, really pretty for me. So definitely give it a try. Um, it's a medium viscosity resin and it sets up in about 20 minutes after you mix it. So you do have to work very fast with it. I mean, once you're done mixing, you gotta start pouring. Um, I didn't let my resin sit at all before I made this coaster. I just mixed up my resin and then I started pouring dropped down my alcohol inks and um, did my flower petals. But I hope you guys give this a try. Here's what it would look like on a darker background. Really pretty as well. This is such a fun technique. I'm having so much fun making these flower coasters. Let me know what you guys think of this one down in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already and go check out a few more of my other videos. That would really help me out a lot. Helps out my channel if you watch a few of my videos back to back. And as always, I'll link all the materials I used down below in the description box along with any coupon codes that I have. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I appreciate you all so much. I hope you're all doing fantastic and I will see you guys soon for another video. Bye guys.